So here we are with iOS 6 on the new iPad. Now a lot of people have been complaining about uh, Apple's Maps feature, so uh, we're going to show you a way to get Google Maps back onto your iPad or iPhone device. So basically all you have to do is, the first thing you should do is go into settings and if you go to the new privacy feature, make sure location settings are turned on and specifically if you turn on the location for Safari because that's how you're going to be accessing Google Maps if you want to get directions and make sure you get located by GPS. So once that's done, you go to Safari, just pop it up, and you go to Maps dot google dot com that should bring you up Ooh, let's try that again maps dot google dot com and it will conveniently ask you if you want to install uh, it onto your home screen so you just tap the button there add to home screen you can call it whatever you want but obviously Google Maps is uh, the name to have and then there you go you will now have Google Maps located onto your home screen so when you click into it it's uh, located us uh, you just want to tap that to get located if you want directions you type in there say where you want to go if you want to go to London Bridge press next uh, it will show you the written directions now you just have to look out if you want to get the map you just have to click there and then there you go you get the guide as before you can zoom in zoom out uh, and it should follow you when you start walking um, just tap on the uh, location button there to um, make sure you're going the right way it loads pretty pretty quickly considering it's uh, running off the browser um, and yeah there you go that's how you get Google Maps back on your iOS 6 device